Yo, what up, everybody? Cardboard Moses with you. Welcome. Time to do another break. We're going to go ahead and do 2018 World Cup Prism Soccer PYT number four. Oh, not to mention, this break does come with a $100 break credit giveaway. So someone in this break is going to be receiving a $100 break credit. All right, you know what? I'm going to make a change here. For all his hard work, hook my boy up with a little something, something. It's not much, but it's a little something. That's not what I wanted to do. There you go. Make this a little bit bigger. There we go. Everybody making their requests. Yo. 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 Abraham. Why why do you why you do this? Good luck, everybody. Good luck, everybody. That's what I'm talking about. Coolio. So, Mom, I see some requests here. We have Sebastian Larson of Sweden, Ronaldo for Portugal, Lecky of Australia, Luis Suarez, Uruguay, Matthew Lecky. Well, I got the Lecky already for Australia. Uh, Me Mehmet Ozil for Germany, Miroslav Klose. And this is a full case, baby. England, Wayne Rooney. Pulisic for USA. All righty. Start off with this one. Oh, okay. I, now I understand what they're doing, Tomas. You're doing your old uh, modern giveaway there, aren't you? You got it, black and gold. Well, either way, if you are in this break, I do wish you the best of luck. Okay, so this pack is ugly. Why do why you do this? Gary in his first soccer break. Let's make it a big one, baby. World Cup right around the corner. I think in nine days the World Cup starts. Oh boy. Try to do this break as quickly as possible. It's still going to take me some time, though. Because so many packs. And it's a full case. Not to mention, I got Classics Football to do after this one. I don't think eBay will mind that much, I mean, considering the fact that stuff is getting broken. So they'll, they'll have fun. 
All right. That's it for the packs in the first box. Let's see what we got here. You know the deal. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. Oh, boy. Already. Is that a super? Osmane Dembele. Out of France. Oh, I thought that was a super. It's a gold vinyl. Number three out of five for the French squad. That's nice. Do I? Even, I don't even. I don't even bring. I need top loaders, yo. That's a filler team, by the way. Filler team hitting already. Yeah, I thought it was a super, but it's a gold vinyl. You know, I'm used to these being supers, but still very nice. All right, what else we got? What are these called again? I think these are velocities or something. Uh, Andreas Grontvist. Out of Sweden. Andre Silva, Portugal. Refractor. A Neymar insert there. A Neymar auto would be ridiculous. Uh, Gonzalo Iguain, Argentina. I'm just going to call these prisms. Tricolor prism of Gregors Krychowak, Poland. You know, this this is great just to just to hear me butcher some of these names. Diego Godin, Uruguay Refractor. Yeah, there won't be an, uh, an autograph in every box. Uh, this is a full case, 12 boxes, so we'll probably see about 7 autographs. Andres Guar Guar Guardado. That font's a little weird to read. For Mexico, that's number 299. Si se puede. Lucas Biglia, Argentina tricolor prism. Uh, Ki Sung Yang from the Korean Republic. That is number 249. A refractor for Timo Werner. Germany. The heck is this? Oh, this is the uh, the Russian name uh, short print variation for Costa Rica. Kelso Borges. These are these are rare. That's a short print right there. So a super short print and a short print in the same case. Not bad. The case hit, if I'm not mistaken, is the uh, the city card or the country card or whatever. Got a refractor here for Pau uh, Pogba and Antoine Griezmann. These boys are going to light it up for the French team. France is looking scary for the World Cup. Man, this World Cup is going to be exciting. Uh, Faikal Fajir, Morocco refractor. Lewandowski. Christian Eriksen, Denmark, Prism. 
Uh, Tricolor Prison for Chicharrito, Javier Hernandez, Mexico, Andres Iniesta, Refractor for Spain, Ahmed Egazi, Egypt Refractor, Diego Godin, Uruguay Prism. All right, that's one box down. Let's keep it going. Yeah, I kind of feel bad for eBay because their breaks are going to get pushed back for a little minute. Uh, the sickest card would have to be this one, the Dembele, 3 out of 5 for France parallel. Uh, and there was also a Costa Rican, uh, Russian name short print variation. What up, uh, Jojo Breaks over on Breakers? Right, Steven? Well, that's that's what I'm here for. That's what I'm here for. Not only do you pay me money for uh, potential greatness hits, but, you know, there's also the entertainment value of me absolutely butchering some of these names. Well, JoJo, you probably are already into this break, huh? I think I have two more cases of this. I'm going to have to uh, consider doing some reductions on some of these teams to get that filled quicker. Um, I'm, yeah, the filler's already full, JoJo, sorry. Yeah, I'm breaking this. I'm breaking it right now. Sorry, JoJo, but yeah, I got, I got the filler full already. So I, I apologize for the... Uh, Confusion there, but as I was saying, I I do have a couple more cases of this. Um, more than likely, I will reduce prices for teams, or I should say for countries to get this filled quicker. But I kind of want to do it as a group stage break. Uh, I, I may I may have to put in one as a group stage break and the other as a PYT. Box two time. What do we have? We have Andreas Gronkvist from Sweden to 199. Sorry, Jojo. We'll get you in the next one, bro. Andreas Cornelius, Denmark, Prism. Tricolor Prism from my boy, James Rodriguez, Colombia. Guillermo Ochoa, prison from Mexico. Supers are black in this thing. Mateo Kovacic, Croatia refractor. This is, I think, this is a short print. Irving Lozano out of Mexico. To twenty. You mean this one, Jojo? Is that, is that what you mean? It also depends on the player. If that were Ronaldo... <laughs> got that right there. Kim Shinwook, Korean Republic uh, Refractor. Or Prism, whatever. <clears throat>
Taisir Al Jassim, Saudi Arabia refractor. Alright, let me grab a top loader one time. For my boy Lozano, number to 25, that's pretty low. That's probably going to be the hit in this box. Or is it? Jaime Penel, Panama, Prism, Nasser Chadley, Belgium, Refractor, the Group C card, we have France, Australia, Peru, Denmark, Refractor on that, gotta random that. We have Neymar with the uh, Scorers Club Refractor for Brazil. We have Mikael Lustig, Sweden, Prism. I think I do a decent job with these names. Ferjani Sassi, Tunisia Refractor. Mats Umus out of Germany. Tricolor prison. My boy, Hamed Rodriguez from Colombia. That is number 299. Miguel Layun, Mexican refractor. Laurent Kosielny, French refractor. Two boxes down. We keep the party going. I think my uh, all my eBay stuff is done here, so I'm gonna try to multitask. Steven, you have a great point there. <laughs> I'm going to attempt to multitask here and send out invoices and break at the same time because uh, our eBay listings are done for today, so I do need to send those invoices. How many of you guys are looking forward to the World Cup since we are doing a World Cup break right now? Y'all know who I'm rooting for? Colombia, baby. But there's some really, really, really good teams. Uruguay, Portugal, France, Argentina, Brazil, Germany, England. I expect all those teams to, to win their group. If I'm not mistaken, the World Cup starts next week. Yes, yeah, Stefan, unfortunately, that's part of our history. You know, as a Colombian, I was alive when that happened. I was very, very young. I was about five, 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 six years old when that happened. But I do have memories of that. You know, my mom crying, like my entire family just being like really, really distraught about that. Um, and, you know, and that hits, that hits close to home because some of you guys know my background. Um, fuck it, I'll just throw it out there. My father actually did 17 years in prison. Uh, he sold cocaine, he trafficked it, he did all that. He did 17 years in prison. So, uh, so when that happened in 94, 
I think it was 94, it wasn't 92, I can't remember, but it was, uh, it was intense, man. It was, like, that one hit extremely close to home. Like, way too close to home. In more ways than one, so. Very tragic situation. But, you know, it's in the past now. We're, as a country, we're trying to move, you know, away from that image that, you know, because most people, when they think of Colombians, they think Pablo Escobar, when that shouldn't be the case. You know, they should think of our beautiful country, our beautiful women, our rich culture, but instead they think about cocaine. It is what it is, but I do expect the Colombian team to have a strong showing in this year's uh, World Cup. I, I hope we can at least make the quarterfinal, maybe even a semifinal. That would be amazing. Oh, my God. Anyways, here we go. Well, yeah, you should think of coffee. We have some of the best coffee in the world. Joao Moutinho for Portugal. Refractor. Well, exactly. There you go, Stefan. <laughs> Taisir Al Jasim, Saudi Arabia refractor. Cocaine is a hell of a drug. Asprick James, well, he's too busy super freaking in it right now with GOD. Denny Alves, refractor for Brazil. Maya Yoshida, Japan refractor. Another Maya Yoshida, Japan Prism. Eden Hazard, Belgium. That's number 10, 149. Kevin De Bruyne. That's the hit to have right there for Belgium. That is the uh, Prism. What is this? Bro, yo, number 30 out of 30, oh my God, Gabriel Bautista, Diego Maradona, Paula de Bala, that is one of the sickest cards I've ever hit, oh my God, bro, that is fucking Amazing. Yo, what'd you get? Only one of the greatest soccer players ever. Maradona. Holy crap, that is huge. Holy sh... I know you want the Messi, but goddamn. Oh, man, that is so sick. I wish it was on card. But that is still disgusting. Speaking of coke, right? Speaking of cocaine, there's Diego Maradona. Should have seen it coming. Man, that is sick. Congratulations to Argentina. Oh, my God. That is nice, man. 30 out of 30. eBay 101. That's nice. That's real nice. All right. Let's keep it going. Uh, Kasper Schmeichel. Denmark Tricolor Prism. Sorry if I blew your speakers, but that is amazing. Shout outs to my boy Mohamed Salah. I hope he can get it together before uh, the World Cup starts because this kid is a beast out of Liverpool. That is a short print, by the way. Uh, Tommy Jurek, Australia Refractor. Hey, ain't that, ain't, that, ain't that a bitch how that works sometimes, Tomas? Sorry, bro. Man, I don't know. I don't know what's sicker: the Lionel Messi one on one I pulled, that Pele. Well, maybe the Pele one on one. That that was probably sicker, but that's still pretty sick. That triple Argentina auto, Jesus. Alex Oslad Chamberlain, English refractor. 
Alvaro Morata, Spain, number 299. What's up, Taylor? Well, this is, uh, that's what I hit. I mean, I don't know how much you're into soccer. Soccer is one of my favorite sports. I know, Stefan, but I, dude, I've never pulled a Maradona auto, ever. But a Bautista on top of that, a Bautista, uh, Batistuta, I'm sorry, I always call him Bautista. It's Batistuta, Maradona, and a Dybala triple. Bro, that's sick. But I would admit, the Lionel Messi 101 is probably better. Or the Pelé 101. The Pelé 101 was pretty nasty, too. Don't, don't sleep on my guy. Uh, Teo, Teofilo Gutierrez, tribe color for the uh, Colombian squad. Ivan Rakitic, Croatian refractor. Motaz Hosawi, Saudi Arabian prism. There you go, Taylor. So you know how amazing that card is, bro. That's Argentine royalty right there. Man, what's in the rest of this case? Makes you wonder. We gonna find out. Mikael Lustig, Sweden Prism. Gabriel Jesus, stud for the Brazil squad. Tricolor Prism. Brazil always has a squad, man. If anyone's counting, this is box four. Yeah, so whoever got that Argentina card might want to sell that like game one of the World Cup. I completely forgot. I got to send invoices here. Yeah, Brazil, Germany, always solid. Uh, Argentina, usually pretty solid. I'm surprised Italy didn't make the World Cup, but then again, they got kind of a, they got a funny situation going on out there. But yeah, for all the, for all of you hoarding that soccer stuff, you might want to sell that within the next week or two. Right, Dragon? Now we just got to get you something nice, man. Got to get everybody something nice. Damn, I just noticed, Patrick. You hit the uh, the Russian name variation short print. The Dabala super short print. Some nice stuff heading your way. I will have another one of these listed. I'm going to lower some prices so we can fill that quicker. Uh, but I'm, I'm also, I want to do it as a group stage break as well. We'll do the eight stages, uh, you know, group A, B, C, D, E, F, G, uh, and H. What is that? Eight groups. And then nine, uh, we'll put a ninth group in, which will be every other team that's not in the World Cup. Like Italy, for example, or USA, uh, to name a couple. All right, we already have. Ooh! 
a Muhammad Salah laser. That is nice. That is nice. Well, Rojo, isn't this a, a Salah short print right here? The Salah laser? That's nice. I Man, I hope he gets back in time, bro. Like, who was it that hurt him? That, that Who's that, bro? I forget. Sergio, I think it was Sergio Ramos? Gotcha, Rojo. I, thought it, I think it is Sergio Ramos that hurt him. Later, Taylor. Appreciate you hanging out. Cristiano Ronaldo. Red Portugal. That's the 149. Got a laser for Idrissa Gueye, Senegal. What do we have here? Martin Odegaard. Autograph out of Norway. Pretty sure nobody gets that one or the triple Argentine. There you go, Norway getting a hit. Sergio Romero. Argentine laser, number two, 125. Jan Sommer, Switzerland laser. This is a laser box right here. Uh, no, Stephen, uh, oddly enough, man, uh, I used to work for this company as a sorter. It was like a little part-time job I had. Munir Mohammadi, Morocco laser. Uh, so, yeah, I started sorting, you know, shipping brakes and stuff for the breakers here. Uh, went to a national a couple years ago in Atlantic City, um, and they pretty much used me to help, like, advertise the Breaker Pavilion and get, like, more people to our table and things like that. And my partners and fellow Breakers and whatnot were really impressed with my gumption, you know, my, my hustle and, you know, how I was getting people to our pavilion and getting into our breaks and just, you know, just... I guess being myself, you know, they uh, thought I had the potential to be a breaker. They uh, gave me the opportunity. I took it. I quit all my other jobs, and I've been doing this ever since. I've been doing this for about a year and a half now as far as a breaker. Um, I don't collect cards. I'm not in the hobby. Um, so that kind of did put a, a, a bit of a, a delay as far as me... Um, you know getting up to speed as, as far as uh as far as you know breaks and what people look for and things of that nature um handling the cards etc etc um but yeah it's as as stefan says i started from the bottom now we here and we only going up baby maya yoshida laser japan uh black and gold says he paused the feed came off the bed when i pulled the triple <laughs> it's a pretty nasty card bro Lukas Fabianski out of Poland to 125. Shout out to the Drake reference. <laughs> Took the L, bounce back. You already know. Dude, for like, I want to say for like the first eight months that I was like trying to be a breaker, I didn't break anything, dude. Like I would maybe break a box a night. Did that for like a for like eight months, and then like it just started clicking after that. You know, I guess it, it, it took me time to learn about the hobby and the cards, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, and just just learning, man. It's a learning curve, especially to st with somebody that does not collect, there's not in the hobby at all. It, it was gonna take some time, but we only getting better, baby. Joao Motinho, Portuguese laser. That's basically my story. 
Started off as a sorter, packer, shipper, and graduated to breaking. And they, bro, they threw me to the wolves, man. They threw me to the wolves. Bro, I, man, I remember I would, I would be streaming for hours. Like eight to ten hours, five times a week. And I would be talking to myself the entire time. Not anymore. Now I have Tomas in, in black and gold to talk to. Oh. Mohammed Salah, Egypt short print. Uh, Italy has not hit anything yet. Mauro Icardi, laser for Argentina. No, not the boss yet, but I did start in the middle. Well, I would say I was lower than the mail room. <laughs> Masato Morishige. Japanese laser. That is numbered to 125. Brian Oviedo. Costa Rican laser. Pedro. Spanish laser. Taha Yassini Kenisi, Tunisian laser. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pat myself on the back. I think I'm doing decent with these names. Mikael Lustig, Swedish laser. It also helps to play FIFA. Hearing the uh, English commentators pronounce some of these names. Carlos Baca, 1099 from Colombia. That's my guy right there. Why, why is that black and gold? Man, you remember what it was like, man. You know, you, you would be in here hanging out with me, just talking to me for hours. Diego Reyes, Mexican laser. Motaz Hasawi, Saudi Arabian laser. That was a laser box, quite clearly. Alrighty then. Got a ways to go. We still got Classics number four. And that's coming up uh, for RipCityCards.com. And then after that, we'll do our eBay breaks. How's everything with you, black and gold? By the way, that's not how you spell Colombian. It's with a O, not a U. Thank you very much. That NyQuil kicking in. There you go, Tomas. Go to sleep, man. Get some rest, bro. Right, black and gold. You remember, man? I would literally stream and just and not and just talk the entire time, not break anything. Yeah, you see black and gold, and like a like a proud papa, you have now you have released me from your wing, and look at me now. There we go, black and just just saying. Just, you know. So Carter Arsenal Brave over on Breakers, what up? All right, Tomas, have a good night, man. Appreciate you hanging out, helping us uh, fill breaks and whatnot, talking to the people, helping us out. Well, black and gold, you should never take things personally, bro. Like, ever. Like, 
I don't think I've treated you any differently now than I have then. Only difference is now I'm actually doing something with my life. You know? All right, Steven. Oh, never mind. Listen, I never had an issue with you, black and gold. But you apparently had an issue with me. It's cool. It's cool. You know, I built a bridge and got over it. You know, it's, it's, it's been nothing but love, black and gold. It's been nothing but love. It, it has never waned, not even once. And that's why you keep coming back, right? Ex exactly. Can't get enough of Uncle Jesse. All right. I have invoices galore to send here. So I'm going to take a quick moment to open up all these tabs. One time for the one time. So I can do this in one swift motion. Well, kind of. All right. That's true. It's true what they say, two-card arsenal. If you ain't got no haters, you ain't popping. See, Brave, with a little positivity? You said this couldn't happen? Look what's happening, Brave! You gotta be positive, dude. Got to. Not only did I fill this, I also filled Classics number four, big guy. Ripping that right after this one. Always positive. Always positive. That's how we do. All right. Let's uh, spread some positive here for the peeps. Especially those that have not hit. Shinji Kagawa. Japanese uh, prism. Not to mention, you helped out a lot, Brave. So I appreciate you, man. Leon Goretzka. Germany tricolor. Well, true, black and gold, true. It's still, it's still been nothing but love. Jefferson Farfan, Peruvian refractor. Alexander Mitrovic, Serbian blue, which is number two hundred ninety-nine. Oh, well, Brave, believe me when I tell you, I ain't listing no more World Cup Prism until the World Cup going to start. Trust me. Not to mention, I'm also going to lower prices and stuff like that. Uh, but, yeah, took an arsenal. I did feel classics. I did. Uh, Rafael Varane, French Prism. Mohamed Al Salawi, Saudi Arabian Red. That's to 149. Nawaf Al Abed, Saudi Arabian Refractor. Mm, nice. A green cracked ice for Tom Rogic from Australia, eh? From a down under. Number to 25, mate. Crikey, that's a good card. I tried to put the uh, accent on there. Oh, I'll see Jim. Well, also, Jim, if you had Australia, you would have had that call, mate. I, could, I, I swear, like, that's that was a pretty decent Australian accent. It's probably bollocks, but whatever. Alan Zhagoev, the D is silent for Russia. For Mother Russia. Hiro, Hiroki Sakai, Japanese refractor. That was an English Australian. <laughs> well, there you go. <laughs> Yeah, my accent's pretty terrible. I combine like a whole like three different countries. It's like an Irish, Australian, Englishman. Oh well, then if you have Australia, then you got your Tom Roger, dog. Boom, you got a little something. Anyways, Emil Forsberg, Swedish refractor. Jordan Henderson, English Refractor. Christian Cueva, 
Peruvian tricolor prism. Chia's mate. Roman Torres. Panamanian tricolor prism. Eden Hazard. Belgian uh, refractor. With exact with a little splash of Scottish. Yeah. It's a it's a character I'm working on. You know, I'm gonna make a YouTube channel, I'm gonna post movies and like little five minute movies. It's an idea I got in my head. Uh Robin Olsen, Sweden Prism. Ooh, 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 that's nice. That's the case hit right there, baby. Repping that Colombia. James Rodriguez. Not James. James. Number 22 out of 25. The National Landmark. That is nice. That's the case hit. That's Columbia right there. Columbia with a oh Naruto. Oh God. That's nice. Got our traditional art right there. Some of our architecture. We got the coffee beans down there. Got some palm trees. Where's the where's the booger sugar? Anyways, there you go. That's a pretty nice card. And we're not even halfway, Red Dragon. Lasse Schoen, Denmark Refractor. That Mojo Variancy on the Landmark card. Very nice. I was going to say Naruto, can I keep it? But no. Nah. My boy got Denmark, Morocco, Nigeria, Serbia, Switzerland, and Tunisia. Bound to get some fire. I know, right, Jimbo? Two cards. Come on, baby. Stay tuned and watch it happen. Who do you think you're talking to, Two Card Arsenal? Wow. When Vincent comes out and says that, oh boy. Are pigs flying? Well, it's too dark. I can't tell. This is the sixth box right here. Alrighty. Keep it going. Uh, Thibaut Courtois, Belgium laser. Brian Ruiz, Costa Rican laser. Tomas Delaney, Denmark Laser. A Red Genki Haraguchi. Japanese number 2149. 
a coque Spanish laser Lee Kyung Ho Korean laser Alexandre Lacazette French Lazare Number 125 Oui, oui, mon ami uh, Alex Iwobi Nigerian laser A gold laser? For Daniel Sturridge that's nice. What are those number two? They're number to ten. I'm sorry, fifteen. Two out of fifteen. That's nice. That's real nice. What else? What else? What else? Hugo Yoris, French laser. Alex Oxlad Chamberlain, English laser. Kara Boji, Senegal laser. Ramadan Sobi, Egyptian, number to 65. Fidel Escobar, Panamanian laser. Jalal Hosseini, the Islamic Republic of Iran laser. Miranda from Brazil, number 125, the laser. Cristiano Ronaldo for Portugal laser so another laser box here Danny Alves Brazil laser all right so we've done half a case got another half to go we ain't done yet this is just the tip of this iceberg so eBay I am terribly sorry but your breaks are going to be delayed by at least an hour and a half. Maybe two hours. Because after this break, which will probably take me another 45 minutes, I have a classics break to do. Full case of that. That's going to take me probably another hour or so. So our Evo breaks are going to start a bit late tonight. But we will get them done, believe you me. Speaking of eBay, multitasking here, sending invoices. Open a pack, send an invoice. <laughs> Open a pack, send an invoice. Alright, some of these have errors on them, so that's the that, uh, international shipping business with through eBay. That global shipping program must be a pain in the ass. Oh, 
I'm done sending invoices. I think I'm missing one invoice. Kind of messed that one up. Jedinak, Australian Tricolor Prism. Ki Sun Wing, Korean Republic Refractor. Brian Oviedo, Costa Rican Refractor. Hiroki Sakai, Japanese Prism. We have Casper Schmeichel, Denmark Refractor. Son Huang Mi, Korean Republic, number to 65. Nawaf Al Abed, Saudi Arabian, Prism. Alan Jagoev. Russian Refractor, Leon Goretzka, German Refractor, for France, Anthony Martial, the autograph. That's nice. You can play the midfield. You can play forward. Versatile player. Nice hit for France. Moses Simone. Nigerian tricolor prism. Eden Hazard, Belgium. Tricolor prism. Kadim Diaye, Senegal. Refractor. Leroy Sané, Germany, German uh, Prism, Miguel Layun, Mexican Blue, number 289, Marcus Berg, Sweden Refractor or Prism, whatever. Uh, Mohamed Salah. Don't see these too often for Egypt. That's nice. Gabriel Torres, Panamanian Refractor. Alright, we got five more boxes to go. How come, Brave? Didn't make the squad, didn't make the final squad. Yeah, that French team is pretty loaded already, man. Antoine Griezmann, Pogma, I mean Pogba. Eight. 
Is uh, Benzema playing for France? They have Giroud too. Yeah, they got way too many attackers for for them. I thought Benzema was French. Too old or something? <laughs> Jay coming in, coming out of the woodwork. He is French, but he's useless internationally. Damn. That's kind of... Yo, one of the... Man, he's a world-class striker. To say he's useless internationally, that's rough. Well, then again, there's a few of those players that are useless internationally. Like uh, Lionel Messi for a while there. Kind of useless for Argentina internationally. Ah, got it, Brave. So there was like a... a se man, why is there always a sex tape scandal, man? You know, pretty soon there's going to be a scandal with me. Oh, Cardboard Moses. Breaker extraordinaire caught in a... In a massive sex tape scandal. Dude, I love... Dude, Giroud, is, Giroud plays great for France. So is that is that what you're saying, Jay? That Benzema and Giroud are like opposite ends of the spectrum. Benzema, world class for his club squad. I think he plays for Real Madrid. Uh, but for France, meh. As opposed to Giroud. I don't even know Giroud's uh, uh, club team. But I know he plays for France. And when he plays for France, guy's a, that guy's a stud. Especially in set pieces. Coming off of corners and free kicks. That guy seems to just always be in the, uh, always seems to be, to be around. Dude, Benzema used to be, well, I mean, damn, time is a motherfucker. If Benzema's looking to move Real, wow. I mean, Real looking to move Benzema, that's what I meant. Yeah, Giroud is a stud. I've never, I've only ever seen him play for the French squad. That's why I say what I say. I don't even know who he plays for as far as his club team. But for France, the guy's always around the ball. And he's tall as shit. Ooh, Miroslav Klose. Nice. This case has been pretty good. Miroslav Klose with the autograph for the German squad. That is nice. Oh, so his fitness is not there, Jay. Gotcha. That's a really, man, Brave, you're taking the words out of me. I, I had a whole thing going. I, would, I don't know about where, the greatest World Cup player ever. I'm sure there's a few players that will have something to say about that. But he does have the most goals in World Cup history. Striker, forward, baller for the German squad. That is a nice card. That's sick. Uh, Sebastian Larsson, Swedish tricolor. So Giroud now plays for, he plays for Arsenal or he plays for, for Chelsea? Neymar Jr., refractor for Brazil. Matthew Leckie, Australian refractor. <sighs> you can't deny the man is a legend, Jay. Antoine Griezmann. The uh, French Messi here, if you will. 
Lucas Biglia out of uh, Argentina, number 299. Got four boxes left in the rest of this one. Alan Zhagoev, Russian Prism. Blas Perez, Panamanian Refractor. Yeom Kihun, Korean Republic Refractor. Nasser Chadli. Belgium Refractor. Kim Ki He. Korean Republic Prism. Angel Di Maria. Argentine Tricolor Prism. We have Shinji Kagawa, Japanese Prism. Andre Carrillo, Peruvian Blue, which is number two, 199. Shinji Kagawa, Japanese Refractor. Laurent Koscielny, French refractor. Giovanni Dos Santos, Mexican prism. All right, four boxes left. I was watching uh, since we're since we're doing a World Cup break. There's a video on uh, I don't know how old it is, but there's a video on YouTube of the top 50 greatest moments in World Cup history. Uh, it's a BBC documentary, so you know it's good. The UK documentaries are pretty pretty awesome. But anyway, they were. Uh, they were talking about like a whole bunch of uh, different important World Cup moments and, what, and whatnot. One of them was the Zinedine Zidane headbutt heard around the world. I, I believe it was, I want to say 2000, 2001 or something like that. It was France and Italy in the World Cup final. And Zinedine Zidane straight up headbutts an Italian defender. Was it? It was 2006. Okay. So yeah, 2006. Zinedine Zidane headbutts the, the crap out of this uh, Italian defender. And like when I was watching it, I was I was stunned. I was like, "What the hell, Zidane? Like by far the greatest French player, maybe aside from Thierry Henry, Zinedine Zidane, greatest French footballer ever." And he throw in, and that French team probably could have won that game, but they had to play the rest of that match with ten men because Adon got uh, got red carded, got thrown out the game. Turns out, right, Materazzi. Turns out, homeboy said he's uh, Zinedine Zidane was like, oh, uh, if you like this jersey, you know, because he kept pulling on his jersey or something like that. He must have said, I think he said something to the uh, to the effect of like, oh, if you want. If you want this jersey so much, why don't you just take it? And then Matarazzi's reply was like, I'd rather have your sisters or something like that, right? Like he talked about his sister. I know that much. Zidane turns around, stares in his soul. And you could tell in that split second, he knew exactly what he was going to do. And he knew the exact repercussions. And the man gave zero fucks. He's like, I already got my World Cup in 2002. I'm straight. 
I'm gonna headbutt this fucker one time for the one time, and I'm peacing out. And that was the last time he ever played a game. Walks right past the, the World Cup trophy, doesn't even look at it. Oh yeah, he's, he definitely should have gotten a better hit. I mean, don't get me wrong. A headbutt from Zinedine Zidane, or like any footballer, is probably enough to definitely hurt. But, uh, I mean, the dude hit him solid in the chest. Like, yeah, it was solid contact, like solid, solid headbutt to the, to the chest piece. Would not be surprised if there's like minor internal bleeding there for poor Matarazzi. But if I was a Don, I, I definitely would have took it up a notch. I would have put a boot to the side of his head or something. Anyway, let's continue this here. Just, you know, needed something to pass the time while I open packs. Uh, Camille Glick, Polish Refractor. Sergio Aguero, Argentine Refractor. Robert Lewandowski, Polish uh, Prism. Munir Mohammadi, Moroccan Prism. Stefan Licksteiner, Switzerland. Refractor. Yeah, dude, I would have bit his ear off like Tyson. I'd, bro, I would have. Talk about my sister, dog? I would have swept his leg, Johnny. <laughs> Sweep the leg, Johnny! <laughs> Uh, Kim Sung Ju, Korean Republic Refractor. Sweep the leg. A Mula autograph would be insane. Uh, Berkir Jarnison. Those Iceland names are a doozy. I hear that's the hardest language to learn. Alvaro Morata, Spanish tricolor. Of all the nation's names to pronounce, I find that Iceland is the most difficult. Allison, Brazil. What is that? A Mohammed Salah orange for Egypt. That's nice. Number to 65. You think Greek is the toughest language, Jay? Every Iceland name player does kind of end in sun. I mean, what what are they? They're like Vikings and stuff, aren't they? Odinson. All oh, all oh. descendants from Odin. Marco Ureña, Costa Rican refractor. What do we have here? We have Freddy Jund Jundberg. I think the L is silent on that. Freddy Jungberg from Sweden, the autograph. Are those hieroglyphics? Like, I guess that's an auto. Oh, the J is silent. So Lundberg. So Lundberg. Freddy Lundberg. There we go. Another legend in the thing. Nice one right there. Ospina, keeper for Colombia. We're going to need you to be big time, boy. Who's this club team again? Was he like play for like Arsenal or something? Anyways. Hector Herrera, Mexican tricolor. 
Also, Ospina is Arsenal. Wait, did I say Arsenal? He's not even the starter. <laughs> well, at least he plays for Arsenal. I mean, better than playing in, in the MLS. I'm kidding. The MLS is actually getting way better. Coque, Spain, Refractor. Jonas or Jonas Hector, German uh, business there. Angel Di Maria, Argentine Blue, number to 189. Yeah, Peter Cech is one of the greatest keepers ever. Three boxes left. Peter Cech. There's also that dude from uh, Italy. What's his name? I got I got his face, but I can't put a name to him right to, to him right now. And for a while, Spain had one of the the best keepers too. Again, I can't remember his name either. Buffon. That's right, Buffon. He might be the greatest goalkeeper. Well, I am biased in this sense. Greatest goalkeeper I ever seen, because he's the gr the the craziest goalkeeper I ever seen. Yeah, Iker Casillas for Spain. That guy was a stud. But Rene Iguita for Colombia back in the day. You guys would know him. For his scorpion kick. True soccer fans know about Rene Higuita. Cra one of the craziest keepers ever. He would block. He would block with his fucking feet. Scorpion kick and fools. And he would take the ball out. Dribble for goals and whatnot. So we'd have like 12 men on the pitch. He was highly inconsistent. But one of the most fun players ever to watch yeah David De Gea is a stud right now for Spain but I don't know man I, I would probably have to give it to Buffon Buffon is unreal Mexico had a pretty decent keeper for a while there God, I love soccer. I wish soccer was a bigger deal here in the States, man. I think I think it's slowly getting there. The MLS is getting better and better. You know, the the English club teams and whatnot do have like a like a hundred year head start on the MLS, but they are getting better and better. Dude, the MLS had, like, I was talking crap about it a while ago, and then I started, like, actually watching games and, like, just doing research on the players and whatnot, and the league is getting stronger and stronger, man. All right, what else we got? It still does not compare to, you know, to the overseas leagues, to the top leagues, but... They're slowly getting there. Mateo Kovacic. Kovacic. I think that's how you pronounce that. Mateo Kovacic. Croatian refractor. Let's see what we can do for you, Brave. Uh, for Australia, Mile Jedinak and Tim Cahill. Tim Cahill, a legend for Australia. It's a nice refractor there. Tysir Al Jassim, refractor for Saudi Arabia.
Mark Andre Ter Stegen. That's a really pretty good keeper there too, right there. For the German squad. Nice. Del Ali, the number ten for the English national team. It's a nice card. It's a nice card. Del A. Del A Ali. There you go. The number ten deserves proper pronunciation. Pepe, Portugal, Tricolor. Thomas Rodriguez, Colombian Refractor, Farjani Sassi, Tunisian uh, Refractor, Sassi a, a stud too, Mohamed Salah, Egyptian, Odeli, got it, freaking Englishman, Sergio Busquets, Spanish Refractor, or Prism, Ivan Rakitic, Croatian, number two one forty nine. Miguel Layun, Mexican ref uh, refractor. Oh boy, Arkadiusz Milik. Try pronouncing that one. Polish to 189. Oh boy. Ali Reza, Johan Baksh, Iran, Tricolor Prism. Mats Umels, German Refractor. Peter Ankerson, Denmark, Priism. What have we got? Oh, Lewandowski, dude. Dem what, Poland? Who was the other player? Oh, uh. Milik. Thomas Vermeulen, Belgium, Prism. Keita Balde Diao, Senegalese. Is that how you say that? Senegal tricolor. Senegalese, is that even a word? It is now. That's a mean mustache on my boy Kelso. Alright, two boxes left. Let's see, where are we at with the auto so far? We got the Deli, the Freddy, the Close, Marshall, Martin, the Argentine Triple. And then quite a few. I mean, we have the, the Gold Vinyl. We got the Russian name variation or Russian lettering variation. Whatever you call that. Uh, Tom Roger Green, the Hamas Rodriguez... Uh, landmark variation, the Sturridge Gold Laser. Oh, where are we at with the autos? One, two, three, four, five, six of them. Thanks. So we'll probably get one more. Yeah, you know, Jay, I, I, just, I, I try to be. Culture, you know? Culture. I like words. You know, and I like pronouncing words in their uh, native tongue, if you will. The Odegaard, technically, the insert auto. Well, which one's the Odegaard? Not that. Uh, 
Oh, gotcha. That one. I wonder if I use it in the proper context, though. Sen Senegalese? Man, eBay, I love you guys, but uh, breaks are going to be pushed back here for a little bit longer. Because I do have classic football number four to do right after this. Unless, you know, let's take it to a vote here. For those of you that are in classics football number four... Do you guys mind if I do the eBay breaks first, or... Or you want to get done now? Yeah, I'm checking my eBay messages. I'm surprised I'm not bombarded then. down because classics that's another break that's gonna that's gonna take a while Over here, this is in the way. I'm gonna respond to this eBay customer one time, real quick. funded that person or I <coughs> took care of that person anyway <coughs> let me see as far as the eBay breaks I have unparalleled football 28 classics number nine and Donner's basketball 41 here we go let's see what we have here let's see what we got Or we have Casper Schmeichel, Denmark Refractor. Marcus Berg, Swedish Refractor. See a few votes for classics. Jesus Corona, Mexican Refractor. Alexander Lacazette, French Prism, 
Is, oh, again? No, nah, it's a different dude. Sebastian Larson. Swedish autograph. Did Sweden? Sweden just dual auto that thing. Dark Horse Sweden with two autos. Congrats. Excuse me. I met a Ghazi. Egyptian tricolor prism. Jamie Vardy. English refractor. Maxi Pereira. Uruguayan refractor. <coughs> Marcus Berg. Prism. Sweden. <coughs> Excuse me. Golo Conte, France, to 149. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Jeez, man. All this dust in this office. Well, yeah, uh, Naruto, that goes without saying. Brian Ruiz, Costa Rica, Prism. <coughs> Sardar, as Moon, Iran Tricolor. <coughs> Freaking dying over here. We have Alexander Golovin, or Golovin. Russian Refractor, uh, Aris Seferovic, Switzerland Blue, that's the 189, so we got seven autos, <coughs> Gabriel Gomez, Panamanian, Tricolor, Kevin Mirayas, Belgium Refractor. <coughs> Andy Polo, Peruvian Refractor. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. And gals. Alright, that's going to do it for that box. Last box, Mojo. Let's see, I got classics eBay, classics eBay, classics eBay. Looks like a tie so far. Gonna have to roll the die or something on that. Last box mojo. Let's see, on parallel football, super quick break. That's going to take maybe 15 minutes. Classics football half case. That's going to take some time. That'll probably take about 45 minutes. And Donruss basketball, that'll also take about 45 minutes. So the eBay breaks alone, probably going to be about two hours. That Classics football break on its own is probably going to take an hour and a half. <laughs> so seeing as I uh, have a tie here, Michael says classics. I got someone on eBay that voted eBay. <clears throat> someone on Breakers that voted eBay. I mean, so classics and uh, eBay at a, at a at a deadlock right now. So I'm gonna make a decision here. I'm gonna roll a die for that and let the die decide what we do. Both are getting done tonight. As you know, on this live stream, it's getting done. 
the eBay and Classics number four. The order though will be random. <clears throat> All right, last box mojo right here. Well, Toby, we also have breaks on our website, my man, ripcitycards.com. So when breaks fill on my website, we break them right then and there. We filled this break. We actually filled two cases before eBay. So that's what we're doing right now, ripcitycards.com. Check it out, Toby. Although I don't have any more soccer right now. I will have to load some more soccer in the store. We have Brio and Bolo, Swiss Laser, Lukas Fabianski, Polish Laser, looks like a laser box. Rim, I'm sorry, Kim Yung Wong, Korean Laser, Maya Yoshida, Japanese. Uh, number 39. <clears throat> Blaise Matuidi. French laser. Alan Jagoev. Russian blue. That number 289. Esam El Haddadi. Egyptian laser. Gilfi Sigurdsson, Iceland Laser. <clears throat> Romelu Lukaku, Belgium Laser. Andre Silva, Portuguese uh, Laser, number to 175. Yoshimar Yotun, Peruvian Laser, Sergio Aguero, Argentine Laser, number 225, <clears throat> Matias Vecino, Uruguayan Laser, Medi Benacia, Moroccan Laser, we have, oh boy, Wojciech Sheshkeni, Polish laser. That made my head hurt. Hector Herrera, Mexican laser. Yeah, I'm going to wait for the World Cup to list it, uh, Brave. Alireza Jahan Baksh, Iran. Laser. I ran so far away. Couldn't get away. Alright, what's in this last stack here? Alright, Lukas Fabianski. Polish laser. Number to 125. <clears throat> That's going to do it for the break. Solid case. Of course, that only goes to those that hit, as I just hit this uh, camera here. So that was solid for those teams that hit. We do have one thing to random, and it's this right here, the Group C card. Let's roll the die. So we're going to go three times in the randomizer. Top uh, country will be receiving that. Group C. Let's go ahead and open up the random. Go to the list randomizer. So we have France. We have Peru. Australia. Spell Australia right. And Denmark. Let's 
go ahead and uh, go in the random three times per the die roll. Top Nation will receive the Group C card. Here we go. That's one. That's two. And the money shot three. Boom. Three times. Denmark will be receiving this Group C insert. Sorry, Aussie. So the Group C card going to Denmark. And now for the recap. So two Swedish autos. We have Sebastian Larson, Sweden. Freddy uh, Lundberg, Sweden. Deli Ali, England. Amirsaf Klose for Germany. Sick. Anthony Marshall. French, Martin Odegaard out of Norway, and the Triple Auto, Gabriel Batistuta, Diego Maradona, and Paulo Dybala, Triple Auto for Argentina, number 30 out of 30, absolute sick, and then some nice things here, a Dembele, 3 out of 5, Costa Rican, uh, Russian name variation, a Lozano to 20, a Salah laser, a couple of Salahs in this case actually, Tom Rogic, Australia number to 25, the James Rodriguez, Colombian uh, landmark variation to 25, and Daniel Sturge, England to 15. So, decent case here. And that was the break. <clears throat> 2018. World Cup Prism Soccer PYT number four. Thank you very much. We'll get that out to you. Oh, guess what? We ain't done. Nope. No, we are not. One last thing I need to do. Somebody's got to win the break credit in this. You thought I forgot, huh? No, no, I didn't. I, I kind of did. But I didn't. All right. So what's going to happen now is somebody's got to win a $100 break credit. For joining this break. You get a chance to win a hundred dollar break credit. So I'm gonna roll the die and see uh, what we get. Oh wow! I rolled another number three. Okay. So we're gonna go three times in the random. Top name will be receiving a hundred dollar break credit via email. Thank you very much. Here we go. Good luck, y'all. So we got one. Two and the money shot three. Boom, three times. And my man Scott V winning a hundred dollar break credit. Scott, did you just one shot that? Yeah, you did. Wow, ain't that something? My boy Ryan was second. Scott Varell with the one shot mojo. There you go, black and gold. Winning yourself some break credit. And that was the break. Thank you very much. We'll get that out to you.